a very good morning my dear children children now we will start a new lesson lesson 4 we need shelter in the class i have taught you but i have not completed so i will start from the beginning only okay so all of you please give here class work and today's date 200622 okay a very good morning my dear children children today we will start lesson 4 we need shelter in my class i have taught you but i have not completed so from the beginning i shall start okay so let all of you please put here cw and put today's date today's date is 200622 we need shelter shelter means what shelter what is the spelling of it just you see s h e l t e r shelter shelter so shelter means to protect yourself or another person or things from bad weather dangers or attack so where you feel the protection that is called the shelter okay shelter shelter so we need shelter so let's see set go get set go now see here join the dots so you have done this one right yes i have not done so those who have not done so like me all of you do in your book okay so like this you have to join the dots then what you can see that it is a house so what did you get yes we get h o u s e house so we get house a house protects us from heat cold wind rain and wild animals so house protects us from heat cold wind rain and wild animals okay and for this what happen we feel safe in our house so long long ago people lived in caves so early people where they lived they lived in caves so early people lived in caves later they built houses they used mud straw and stones to build houses so early people they used to live in caves but uh, ultimately means so early people gradually they now know how to make a house with the you means so early people gradually they now know how to make a house with the you means now the early people started making the houses okay with what mud straw and stones and this materials they can get easily okay now all of you see this topic what are houses made of what are houses made of in villages in villages some houses are made of mud and straw such houses are kachcha houses so what is the spelling of kachcha houses k a c h c a j kachcha h o u s e s houses kachcha houses so kachcha houses are made up of mud and straw okay and they are not permanent so in towns 
and cities most houses are made of bricks so in towns and cities houses are made up of bricks and cement so such houses are called pakka houses p u c c a pakka h o u s e s houses so children all of you see very carefully in villages the houses are made up of mud and straw and they are called kachcha houses okay and in towns and cities the houses are made up of bricks and cements cement so this type of house are known as pakka houses pakka houses are stronger than kachcha houses so pakka houses are very much stronger than the kachcha houses people build houses with materials that they find easily so people used to build their houses with the materials that they can get easily made of different materials such as straw mud dry leaves bamboo wood bricks cement and stones so houses are made up of different materials so what are the materials materials are straw mud dry leaves bamboo wood bricks cement and stones this is the kachcha houses this is a kachcha house see here it is made up of straw this is the straw and mud okay so uh, bamboo also are there wood and etc so these are called kachcha houses and pakka houses in which you are living okay so which we live those particular um, houses are made up of cement bricks and stones and etc so those houses are known as